Oh, good morning, morning Team Southside, where teamwork, teamwork makes the dream work. work. Bailey Christopher here. And Charlie K. Scott. And we are from fifth grade. Fifth grade, Miss Coyle's class. Oh, yeah. So, what? Good job, guys. And Mr. Beatty and... Come on, Miss Margo! Miss Margo! Margo, all right. Good and job doing the introduction there, thanks, ladies. Thanks, guys. That's Thank the you. Southside first. Okay, yeah. so you want to lead us in the pledge, Bailey and yeah. Charlie? Yes, okay, please. here we go. I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United, the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. That was absolutely well done. fantastic, well ladies. Well done, guys. Also, later uh, in our announcements, Bailey and Charlie are going to show all of us how we can use a really great tool for Kelso's Choices and Problem Solving called the Peace Path. You may have seen it. It is out at the bus circle, spray painted on the pavement. Thank you to Mr. Munez who did that for us. Yep. And it has steps in how to talk it out and listen, to be assertive and be a reflective listener. So you're going to get to see that in action. Later, you're going to see some younger kids with a different problem on another video. That's show right. us how they would use the peace path. Thank yeah. you so much, ladies. Yeah, good job. Yeah. Good. Okay. Yeah. All right, guys. So here we have... Bailey Christopher and Charlie K. To help us learn how to use the Peace Path, one of our main Kelso's choices is talk it out, and the Peace Path is a great way to do it. So these ladies have a problem that they're going to use the Peace Path, peace path to solve, okay? So it says yellow feet go first. Bailey is the one who has the problem to solve, so she's gonna go first. All right, Bailey. I feel upset when you pretend to hurt me with a ball and end up like breaking something like as in my nails. I know you feel upset when I try when I try to pretend to hurt you and break your nail. Well, I feel I feel sad when I when I pretend to hurt you because I don't necessarily mean to. I know when you feel sad when you don't mean to actually hurt me. What can I do to make it right? Um, I need you to like be more careful and be understandable and like actually be have empathy for me and like pretend to be me and like feel how I would feel if that would happen. Mm -hmm. I will have more empathy for you next time I try. Thank you. I I need you to um like understand that I'm not meaning to hurt you. It was just an accident. I what I can do what can I do to make it right? I will be more understandable and understand the way that you try to do it, like what you try to do and I'll be having more empathy and like like I said, like trying to be you and thank you. Thank you, go first. From now on, I will have more empathy for you when, when, I, when I not purposely try to. Maybe try other ways to be funny. Yeah, yeah. when I try other ways. For now on, I will understand what, what you mean and have more empathy and use Kelso choices. Shake hands, leave in peace, COVID style. Woo! Woo! Good job, friends. Thank you. So now we're going to move on to the SM mystery for this week. Okay, Stallions, it's time for our SM mystery for this week. And we have two special guests that are going to help us with our SM mystery. I'm going to let them introduce themselves. Hi, I'm Bennett. Hi, I'm Logan. And can you tell us what grade and class you're from? We're in first grade and we're from Miss Blevins' class. All right, Miss Blevins' class. So, great job. That's the mystery for Miss Blevins' class. Can you tell us what the S mystery question is? How uh, many parking lots are in the parking space? 
Well, parking spaces are in the parking lot. Okay, how many parking spaces in the parking lot? Now, what's the first thing we do with this number? Do you remember? In our mind. Um, we think about something... Too small and too big. Yeah, too small and too big. Here, I'm going to go to the back. So, too small and too big. A number that's way too small, couldn't be that small. A number way too big, too big, and something in between. So, all right. We look forward to hearing some more clues from Ms. Blevins' class this week and start thinking about those parking spaces, guys. Thanks so much, and we'll see you back tomorrow. All right. Bye. 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 Okay, Stallions, will someone see you being safe, respectful, and responsible today? We, we know that they will That's because right. we see it all the time. Mm -hmm. Hopefully you'll be wearing your mask, yep. keeping that up over your nose and mouth, keeping your social distance. Yep. Monster arms, mm -hmm. okay, for certain grade levels. That's yep. right. And, and washing hands washing and hands. using sanitizer. And sanitizer. All that stuff helps us all be healthy and safe so we can yeah, all be at school. So, that's right. Take it away. Yeah. Good job. All right. Thank you, guys. Thank and you. remember, it's always, always a, great a great day, day to be a Southside Stallion. Bye. 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 Thanks for watching.